there was a woman who won the national prize for chocolate chip cookie in these United States. She made the sweetest homemade chocolate chip cookie from scratch in America. I was driving through Alabama one night. It must have been 2 in the morning. I'm listening to her being interviewed on the radio. And, and they were just given a block of raw bitter chocolate and, and all, flour and all these ingredients. Everybody received the same thing. And they were given so much time. <clears throat> and everyone made their chocolate chip cookie. But hers was a chocolate chunk cookie. I need to find this sister in fellowship with her. I need to have a very large glass of cold milk with me so that we can pray properly <laughs> before I dive into one of those chocolate chunk cookies. They're thick. They were bread-like. And, and the reason why the judges went crazy is that as they bit it, it melted in your mouth, both the cookie and the chocolate. So she was asked on the radio interview, how is it that having the same bitter block of chocolate that everybody else had, why is it that your chocolate was the sweetest and the most consistent uh, melting uh, uh, quality when it hit the mouth, not on the hands? And how is it that this happened? And she says, right here on national radio, you just made a cookbook. It'll help you sell the book because the cookie recipe's in there. And she says, well, the secret was when I melted the chocolate, Chocolate, when I added the sugars and the butters and other things that I throw into my chocolate, she says, the last thing was a pinch of salt. The radio interviewer said, why salt? She says, the salt does two things. It inhibits the bitterness and accentuates the sweetness. Two things. It inhibits the bitterness and accentuates the sweetness. She said, when I use this pinch of salt, you don't want to overdo it. You don't want salty chocolate chips. You want sweet ones. And, she, and so you see, my brothers and sisters, that's how God's people can be. Our lives in serving others and ministering to others and then sharing to, to them why we live this way can inhibit the bitterness in someone's life and accentuate the sweetness of Jesus to them. Salt is powerful.